Hello guys, welcome back again. So I have some time to record an episode, and oh my, look at that village. It's quite amazing, isn't it? It's coming together nicely. Let's just get these slimes out of here. <clears throat> they aren't doing us any good. Yeah, so the village is coming along great. I've been working on it a little bit. I did build this magnificent building over here. It's pretty awesome. I'll show you what is inside of it in a minute, but actually I want to take you guys downstairs because <clears throat> I have been working down here. Whoa! That was a close one. I do got a lot of stone bricks and rails. We will be using those today. But here's what I've been doing. Put a border around and some more wall. We're going to slowly cave this into the top. It's going to look magnificent. And nothing back there. So that's it, I've just been doing that, and I had to move the ceiling up, and if you can see, uh, I have to dig the ceiling all the way up there, <clears throat> that will take quite a while, I can get that done off camera. So we're going to go up now, and see this awesome building I made, didn't take too long to make, but it could have been shorter because where's my door uh... I think zombies broke into it anyways dang it <laughs> I I changed this path instead of it being five blocks wide I narrowed it down and made it go this way to our dock but anyways this building what it is it is a, a facility to make stone bricks I'll show you it in a second but we have these magnificent tanks pumping water out of the ocean they're pumping water out of the ocean and they are bringing it into the building. Got some redstone going. Got some lava. Now I wanted this to be flat, but I had to add these blocks here for the redstone. But I wish it was flat. Because then it look better. I think I should close this off right here. Don't I think it's fine though. Should be fine just in case. A couple blocks there. So this would I didn't want this here and I didn't want Oh no. Oh no. But they had to go there for the redstone. We got this cool bridge going. I tried a different design. I like it. This kind of looks like it's floating now. See this? See that? Looks like it's floating a little bit. So I'm not sure what I'm going to do there. Uh, this will lead off. will be a house here, a house here, maybe a house there. Down here. I know. We're going to go in there. Don't worry. <laughs> I got a furnace room. And... Now we can go in. So we have a cool entrance. You got some redstone lamps. We got these staircases going up on the front. It looks really nice. And instead of a plain wood roof, we got these going on the raised up one. Those look pretty awesome. And here it is. Ooh, we made some wood stone. <coughs> Here it is, so the lava's flowing towards us. 
and looks pretty epic. We got the water being pumped in. So this lever doesn't do anything. It used to, but it doesn't now. I managed to hook it all up to this lever with some basic redstone stuff. And here what it does. So these come down and push it towards us and they make the cobble. So if you if you mine it like this, the cobble, you know, falls into the lava and we don't want that. So what I usually do is <coughs> excuse me, put it down bring it up, let more form, put it down again and then I mine it but yeah that's how that works it's pretty cool um, yeah that's it in this building it's a pretty awesome invention I've wanted to do that for a while now, we finally got it done See if we can make it. Oh, yes. I'm still working on this building. Uh, I did put in some stairs, or I did finish the walls, and I have to do it up there and make a, somehow get us up here. I'll try. Oh, skeleton. Enderman. Uh, but I gotta drop this stuff off at the <clears throat> the stronghold, so we need to get over there and we should go start that now. And I know I said there would be a time lapse, uh, but that is gonna take a lot of time, and I'm short on time right now. Whoa, man, you scared me. <clears throat> Alright, I did try to hook up nether portals to the end. Unfortunately, it didn't work out that well. Ah, jeez, their range is crazy. We got a nugget. Do we want the nugget? Nah. So let's go design. Let's go design our... Here it is. We need to design our pipes and such. Let's do it on peaceful, just so we do not get blown up, because that would be bad. So if you don't know what this is, this is a a design for actually a sewage pipe that we would put underneath our village, and it'd just be fun if we made the zombies go in it and you had to I don't know not let them catch you and then be in the sewer under a village zombie infestation I don't know it'd be pretty awesome but we're gonna design our railroad track it will lead from a place over there all the way to the stronghold actually to a a number of places we got a desert fortress we have a desert village and the stronghold so we will make it go to all those places there's something on my keyboard I'll try to get it ah, okay so I want I want to use the um, the light wood birch wood I want to use that and um, let's, let's try this oh sweet so this is the birch wood and then on that we will have our rails like so I do want to use actual wood but fortunately I don't have any uh, so there's that, and actually, I 
should try this because because uh, I don't want the rails to match whatever they're on. I don't know why. I'm just picky like that. So. Uh, let's get out some other stuff. I was thinking some slabs on the side. Maybe. Uh... Looks okay. Alright. Um, let's try. Let's try to add in some stone bricks. Yeah, I think this, this is too high. I don't want a full block next to it. Let's try some stairs. How those look. I think that looks good. Now let's try the slabs because I definitely want some cobble slabs in there in the mix somewhere. Cool. Maybe put them upside down. I don't know. Uh, and then maybe every so often we will have. I don't know. A support. Yeah. And then you go through the arch or whatever. Something like that. That looks pretty cool. And then we'll have the, the stair like that. That's pretty cool. It'd be pretty awesome to have some little arches every so often. So I think this will be our design, and I have to make sure I want I have to make sure I want this design because uh, we cannot. I mean, once I build this long track, I mean, there's no changing it because I don't want to waste all that time I spent on it. It's a pretty cool design though. See how that looks. Uh, it feels too open then. <clears throat> uh, no, 
not sure which I like better. Oh, that's pretty cool. Gives it more depth than the full block. So you don't feel like you're going to hit your head. And then by the time you see that part, it's, it's gone. So that's pretty awesome. I'd have to think about this, these cobble things because they are pretty thin. Hmm. Yeah, I think I'll have to go with them because they give it, they make it look really open, and I like that. So, hello guys, here's our bridge. I am done with it. Um. So let's go on a ride. Yeah, this took a while to make. The stronghold's just over there. And I used all the stone bricks, pretty much. And a bunch of birch wood rails. And it's pretty nice. Uh, the cart goes at a constant rate. It's not slowing down, which is good. And it's a nice little ride. It's back home. And our nether portal is. I'll show you guys that. Another portal is. I'm gonna let you guys know when we get there. I'm actually recording this a while after uh, the last, the first part of the episode. So this last clip here, me riding back and forth, uh, recording it a while after. There's a four-day weekend this weekend, so hopefully I can get a couple episodes pre-recorded. And another portal's just over there in that forest, uh, up there that mountain somewhere. That's pretty awesome. And over by our stronghold we will build a house on the island. Do you remember the island it was on? We'll build a house on it. It'll look pretty cool and I'll leave that. So thanks for watching. Make sure to leave a like and sub. Bye!